Brand new spot today on a river that I've hunted before, but nowhere near here. And I'm looking for a ford that's kind of lost. No one knows exactly where it is, and if you look at the maps and you read the histories, they know about where it is, but because of the way this river runs, no one knows for sure. So, I just started here at this rock. I'm going to work my way down along this bank uh, for about half a mile looking for horseshoes to see if I can find the ford. This is my very first target. Now I know the ford's not here because it's waist deep. It's much shallower in other places. But this target is a piece of cooking pot. And that's really neat. Not just because it's a piece of cooking pot, but because this means that I'm in a very good area with old stuff. This could easily date to the 1700s. There's no telling what could be along the banks here and in these holes that I'm standing in. So I'm going to slow down and I'm going to hunt the deep stuff even though I know this isn't a ford. The ford's probably down there a little ways. But let's just slow down and take our time and see what we can come up with. There are a bunch of kids swimming just around the bend up there and this just came floating by Budweiser can. I'm sure they just now finished it and pitched it in the river. Isn't that sad? I'll take it out. Well, so far I'm having terrible luck. Found a piece of pig iron, pitchfork, a couple odds and ends, nothing real great. This river is swamped with people today. I've had so many people come by me in kayaks. Um, I cannot find the ford. I'm about two-thirds of the way through the hunt. I haven't found a horseshoe yet. Did find, I did find a nice paddle, though. <laughs> and I'm looking over here. And there's somebody's backpack lodged up in the trees there. So I thought we'd just go ahead and check it out together, if you don't mind. I know it's not real exciting. And uh, hopefully I can get to it. Whoops, I'm stuck. All right, I'm going to have to turn it off for a minute and get a little closer. A backpack, what do you think's in it? I think it's full of guns. Ooh, guns. Ooh, something in there. You know, I didn't bring anything to drink today. I'm dying of thirst. Maybe it's a... Nice ice cold yingling. Yangling. Mm, okay. Let's see what we have here. Camelback. Got something in it. Shall we? Hold on a second, I have to do something. By the way, before we get to this, which is very exciting, we're gonna sit through this, which isn't so exciting. This is the piece of pig iron that I found. It's not a very pretty piece. That's definitely what it is. Ooh, look. It's a bed. It's a bed. And this is the pitch fork, which is in pretty rough shape, but that's an old style. It's hand forged. All right, enough of that. You don't want to see that stuff anyway. Let's see what's in the bag. Ooh, the bag. I feel something. <gasps> what is it? Here we go. Alrighty, next one. Fingers first, no gloves. Ooh, food. Mmm. Oh, yeah, that looks good. Too bad it's open. What else? Oh, something else. Let's see what it is. Live strong. I guess that's sunscreen. <laughs> Excellent. I actually need sunscreen. I'm getting toasted today. We'll use that. What else? And something else. Oh, candy. This is probably like a little girl's backpack. We're little boys. All right. Into the main compartment, shall we? We shall, if we can find our way in. All right. What do we got? Ooh, drinky, drinky. I don't suppose that's uh, an adult beverage. Defenders of Wildlife. That is a nice bottle, though. Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm almost afraid to look at this. <laughs> Litos. This looks like a first aid kit. Trying to figure out how to get into it. That's some needles and threads and some uh, alcohol wipes. 
It's actually fairly dry in there still. All right, what else we got? That's about it. No ID. So there's no way to return anything. But there's really nothing to return anyway. I'll carry this out of here and I'll pitch it, I guess. It doesn't look like it's even worth saving for um, a digging bag. I did find a paddle downstream about 100 yards, probably, from this person. All right. Well, that's probably our big excitement for the day. Hope you enjoyed it.